Hey Gordon, in 60 seconds, what are the different ways of stripping fibre? Well, the most common method is to use a tool like this. It's got small little grooves which we use to strip the fibre. Typically, we're working with 125, 250 and 900 micron fibres. They're very fine in tolerance. I'm just going to hold one up now. So we're dealing with that. And you can imagine, when we're moving our tool across that, we could nick the fibre. So another method is using a thermal strip tool like this. How that method works has an amazing option to use a holder setup. The fibre is placed in a holder, it goes into the thermal stripper, we close the gates, we would have it turned on, it heats up, and then a simple motion like this, once it's heated up, we would strip the fibre. The next step is we can then put that into our cleave, cleaver, do our cleaving, and after it's cleaved, in a very simple step, add that to the device, add that to our machine, our fusion splicer, ready to splice.